Hello, uh, I'm Elias Vafiadis. I'm Group Head of Software Engineering and Technology here at AirAsia. I've started uh, in the software industry about 13 years ago in uh, working with Microsoft uh, Office products. Uh, and back then, what really excited me is that through the uh, power of software, uh, we were able to reach uh, millions of customers at the same time. Back then, uh, everybody who owned a computer was probably running on Windows, and everybody had the Office installed. So the products we were working on would literally reach out every person that uh, owned the computer. So, so that passion continued. Uh, then I found a new interest in the travel industry, and I've spent the last eight years working uh, with Expedia uh, out of their uh, Seattle office. And over there, I, I, I realized that software can do way more than uh, productivity. And so uh, uh, through, through software, we were able to help people uh, book their travel and, and go places. And this is kind of like what transpired me uh, eventually joining AirAsia uh, about a year back. Yes, currently we have a software engineering team uh, in three locations. Uh, we have a team here in Kuala Lumpur in Red Q. Uh, we have uh, opened up a tech center in Bangalore. Uh, we officially launched it uh, back in uh, February of 2019. And we also have a, a small team in Singapore. Uh, the team is currently about uh, 90 uh, software engineers or so. And we're definitely looking to expand it to, to be able to cater uh, for all of the uh, projects and, and the whole digital transformation and AirAsia 3.0. Uh, that, that, that we're going to be uh, doing. So AirAsia 3.0, uh, the, the transformation is about um, changing AirAsia from just being an airline to this uh, travel e-commerce superstore. We're building a platform uh, that will be able to deliver travel products and more uh, to our uh, customers. We have a great spread of customers, passengers traveling across the region through all our destinations. And we want to um, uh, leverage that and, and help uh, our passengers find uh, better travel deals like hotel or holiday packages or offer them some deals, unique deals for the destinations that they're going to. And not only, we want to expand that and, and have our platform be something that they will use on a daily basis. Currently, a person travels once or twice per year on average, uh, depending on their time and uh, money commitments. But we want our platform to help people uh, on a daily basis. So, so we're doing several initiatives around uh, ensuring that our customers can use uh, our application platform on a daily basis. What's really exciting and uh, in line with the 3.0 uh, vision and this daily app use uh, is that uh, we're looking into creating a social aspect to our uh, platform. So um, what we're doing is to create an, an ecosystem where our uh, passengers can uh, talk to each other, meet with each other, and then potentially even plan activities together all the time. All along, like we'll be able to know what their interests are, and then we will be able to offer them relevant offers for, for what they're interested in. So uh, you, you will soon see uh, some of those products come to life. Um, you might have seen in the past couple of months, uh, our, uh, our mobile app offers the capability for passengers on the same flight to talk to each other and, and meet with each other. Uh, we're expanding that capability uh, beyond just uh, the flight uh, component. Absolutely, yeah, Google is uh, one of our uh, core uh, technology partners. Over the last uh, couple of years, we have been uh, migrating more and more of our services into a uh, Google Cloud Platform, or GCP, and we're continuing to do that the rest of the year. We're also partnering with them in, in key initiatives that will help us uh, accelerate our uh, path towards the AirAsia 3.0 vision.